I'm here to get a backpack fitted by the outdoor experts. Do you need to get your backpack fitted? Yes, you do need to be fitted for a backpack, generally because of where the weight will sit on your body. It's very important to keep you comfortable that your bag fits you nicely. Okay, I need a day pack. Mm -hmm. I want to be able to access my reusable bottle easily. I'll probably be doing three or four hours of hiking and jumping on and off aeroplanes, perhaps, and cars. Okay, something nice and lightweight, mm -hmm. a bit versatile as well. I've definitely got a few options for you. So I'll start with this one, the smallest pack I'm going to show you. It's a 20 litre, it's a Tempest it's by Osprey. It's mm. a women's specific fit. That means it's narrow, it's a little bit shorter. And what we like about this is it's super lightweight. It's the very small as well. Very small, the frame is really minimalist. So when you do need to pack it, compressor's really small, it will fit in your suitcase, fit under the seat in front of you on the plane. Okay. Interestingly, I've got the same bag in 10 litres bigger. Ah. This is the same bag, it's the Tempest. You get in 10 litres, not just from the volume of the bag itself, but from this lid here. Right. This lid's got a pocket on the top, and also it's got a lid on the inside. I definitely like that. Got one very different bag here, also a female specific fit by Low Alpine. You've still got, like the others, pockets for your water bottle. You do have a big frame. It's not as minimalist as the others, be a bit better for hiking, not so appropriate when you're trying to get on an aeroplane. <laughs> so it's up to you what suits your needs the most. And are these all waterproof? They've all got a degree of water resistance. The three I've shown you, water resistant. They'll do absolutely fine in a little shower, intermittent rain, absolute deluge. Your stuff will get soaked. It's very important you use dry bags. That's my recommendation over a rain cover. Okay, I'm going to try this one, the 30 litre. Let's try fitting that for you. So if you want to start the hip belt for me, perfect. You want to keep it nice and low on your hips because we want to keep all our central gravity really low and central. Yep. You can tighten these ones if you like, just to bring the weight a bit closer to you. Yep. And the final point is just behind your shoulders, both of those, just ah. to bring again that weight nice and in so that your central gravity is right over your feet. You don't feel like you're being dragged backwards. Okay. You've got three kilos in there at the moment. How do you feel? That feels good. Yeah? Yeah, I like that. It's narrow enough. The shoulders are comfortable. You can narrow those even more if you want. There's an adjustable chest strap. If you want to bring those in a little bit closer, let's mm -hmm. say you're wearing a t-shirt or a vest, that can be nice. How do I know it's fitting properly? So I'm mainly doing it visually. I'm making sure that the top of the frame is in line with your shoulder. Mm -hmm. That means that you can move your head about, you can look over your shoulder, nothing's getting in the way. Yeah, there's nothing worse than having a backpack that's like up here, yep. around your ears. We want the bag to be just an extension of your back itself. So lengthwise, it's finishing at the bottom of your back and stopping at the top of your spine. And in terms of width as well, it's not extending further than your shoulders. So size-wise, it is sitting properly. Mainly it'll be how it moves when you walk. You want it, again, just to be an extension of your back, not swinging around all over the place. And if you would prefer to have it either higher or lower, there is an adjustable back on this bag. It's just using Velcro, and we can move it up or down if you need. That's it, sold. Thanks, Kate, it's really comfortable. Brilliant, I'm glad with the fit. I think it suits you nicely. Please let us know how you get on with it. We'd be interested to hear. Definitely, I will.